Okay, today's scale update. Um, I was having bad luck with the uh, 100 uh, gram load cell um, as far as measuring, you know, less than a tenth of a grain and doing something with it. It was all over the place, not working. Looked all over China for a, you know, a uh, 10 gram or 20 gram load cell and, you know, 20 bucks for a uh, load cell. However, our good old friend, the Wawu type scales are still going for next to nothing and I got one that had a uh, 20 gram limit so that I could rob its 20 gram load cell and take it out of the controller board that we've got here that we know lies to us and either uh, use a different one with bright LEDs for uh, for uh, Mr. Chapin or come up with our own um, a little display like that that doesn't lie anymore so <clears throat> there's the plan I've got myself a 20 gram load cell that means that uh, we're limited to 160 grains or so um, but that's fine for weighing powder and I'd rather have a scale that if it drifted, it showed you it was drifting, and that if you put your stuff on and it wasn't at zero, you'd have to press the tear button, then have one auto zero at zero and creep up while you're trying to trickle. Uh, anyway, that's part of what we're after here. But hey, we got a load cell. I'll let you guys know how it works. Talk to you later. Oh, and you know what? I just thought I'd mention that uh, our little Wawu type scales have so many screws that it couldn't have been a Chinese design. It's Japanese, definitely Japanese. I mean, nobody uses this many screws. Talk to you guys later.